When it comes to packing your saddlebag, the question everyone really asks is, well, what do you actually need? So in this video, I'm gonna run you through all the things that we think you should be taking out on your bike. Let's start off with the obvious one, the inner tube. Now this is a must on any bike ride. Even if you're running tubeless tires, sometimes you'll get that puncture that just won't seal. So having one of these handy will get you out of a lot of trouble. Now some seasoned cyclists will tell you never to use tire levers, but why take the risk? Say you've got really cold hands or you've got a new tire that just won't come off. Having a pair of tire levers makes the whole thing a lot easier. There are multi-tools and then there are multi-tools. But finding the one that best works for you and your bike is really important. There are so many out on the market, so have a good think about which one you wanna get. And ultimately, have it on your bike at all times. And then you'll never be stuck on the side of the road with problems that you can't fix. A small bit of kit, but super effective. If you've broken your chain out on the road, then this is the tool you wanna to use and that's gonna get you back on the road. It's easy to apply and it'll get you up and running in no time. Next up, patches. Now this is something you do not want to overlook. It's easy to carry and they're small and light. But in the unlikely event of a double puncture, this will become your lifeline. Next up, valve extender. If you've got a deep section wheels like these, then having a valve extender is a really important bit of kit. If you're out on a ride and you puncture and you end up borrowing someone's inner tube with a shorter valve, then you just won't be able to pump your tire out without one. Gas canisters, are they worth it? I personally would say yes. Getting your tires up to a sufficient PSI in a matter of seconds is, well, just awesome. If you don't know what a tire boot is, let me explain. It's a piece of tough material that goes on the inside of the tire to seal up any of those splits. Because if you've got a split in that outer tire, then you're susceptible to punctures. Having some spare cash in your saddlebag is something a lot of people forget about. But worst case, it'll be able to get you a taxi home. Or if you've run out of tire boots, it also works well to patch up those holes. But I am gonna say, keep that one quiet, because especially if you're going out on a ride with Lloydy, well, you'll end up buying all the rounds. If you did enjoy this video, then don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And if you'd like to learn more about the tools and how they actually work, then why don't you check out that video down there.